right guys we got the first bushing in here my camera died but I just actually just slipped it in turned my camera back on just so I can get the rest of it on film I'm gonna try not to have it turn off it's been doing something weird but I'm gonna go ahead and set you guys down we're gonna get the gist of this on film Finagling, a lot of freaking brute force, but we were able to get it in with the strength of our hands, our greasy hands. Here we go. On to the next one, but we're gonna be a little smarter. Put both bushings in first and then just kind of coerce it up to the top once we put the airbag in. There we go. making back progress. Yeah. There it is, ladies right. and gentlemen. Two. Gonna run the airlines to them. Come on, baby. You're right there. Uh, basically trying to push it down on that nipple, right? the rest of the way. It's on it. Um. All right guys, last little connection here and we're done with the installation for the airbags. It's gonna go ahead and connect it. We got the clamp on there. Freaking missing one clamp, but that's okay. If anything goes wrong, let's buy one from the store. But uh, yeah, that's what happens when you all excited and unboxing something. You freaking at least lose one thing that's important. So let's get this on here and pump her up with air and see how it helps out. Simple as that. I wish I could get it on a little more, but it's not going on. So. We'll have to make that do. If anything leaks, I'll just freaking seal it up. But this should be good enough, guys. Now that we got the lines all run, I'm gonna go ahead and make this where I fill up my, my uh, air. I'm gonna have the nozzle coming out here. That way, anytime I need to fill it up, it'll be easy access. I might do it on either side, whichever one's easy to run. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some washers and some nuts and make that all nice and solid with a nozzle there for me. There it is, just a simple little washer and a knot lock nut there. And it came up, I went on the other side because it was easier to run because the cable's right here. Got a zip tie, one more thing up there. It goes right into that. I'm not gonna be towing whatsoever, so it goes right into the center. Comes right out right there. Looks pretty spiffy. A really convenient spot to put it instead of having it flopping around in your place. No one will ever even know that that's there. Here we go, guys. I'm gonna get the camera stable for you. Perfect. Now we can go ahead and lower it down. You can already see a big difference in size. I gotta be careful not to jar my camera because it's turning off every time, so I'm gonna do this real slow. Bear with me. There we go. See it bulging out through the edges there? Very nice. That's what we needed. Now it's just a matter of getting the jacks down.
There we go, ladies and gentlemen. A job well done. There it is. Helper springs all installed. 100%. I'd say it took us about a couple hours, but we had a lunch break in between, so hell. Can't hurt us that much on the project. I'm not a mechanic, so. I mean, hell, you can't ask for much more than that. We already got them all. All the lines up and tied off very nicely. I'll probably do one more zip tie right there just to make myself feel nice. But oh yeah, getting the job done just like we wanted to. So there's a quick little installation for everybody who's wanted to see it done. Got my hat completely dirty. Look at that, friggin' got my hat all nasty. But uh, all right, this is EXO signing out another DIY project down the drain, making this thing all nice and stiff. All right, this is EXO. Until the next video, talk to you guys later. <laughs>